Hello and welcome back to Everything Gaming. I hope everyone's staying safe out there. And in today's video, I want to talk about SnowRunner and a really cool feature that has been found. Now, this was posted by someone on a Facebook group and it actually works quite well. And it can be very handy and useful. Now, this feature that I'm going to talk about is moving a truck with goods into your garage with the goods still attached. Now, this will come in very handy, for instance, if you're stuck or if you're out of fuel or if your truck's too damaged and you've got no other trucks nearby to help you out or you just want to cross the map really quickly. So, for instance, in the truck that I've got here, the International Paystar, I've got some metal planks in the back and I need to get them to this mountain bridge in order to get the bridge built, which coincidentally is pretty much right next to my garage. Now, you can only, like I said, do this in a truck that's got built-in sort of facility on the back for storage of materials you cannot do it with an extended trailer uh, or anything like that so when you're on your truck you hit x to go to the global map now you cannot do this from two different maps for instance from black river to smithville garage dam you can only do it from black river to black river garage etc so you can't take it to alaska but when you're on the global map you just hit x again to move to garage while you're in the truck that's got the payload in the back and there you can see I ended up in the garage with the metal planks in the back and I'm pretty much next to the, the mountain bridge so it won't take me long to deliver it. Now like I said this is a great tool if you are stuck or if your vehicle is too damaged, you're out of fuel, whatever the case may be, even if you're just having a lazy moment and you want to get the job done quickly, it's great to work with if you're you know all the way on the other side of the map kind of thing and you need to pass the garage to deliver your materials. So it is a really cool feature but whereas if you're going to sort of just hit the recover vehicle option obviously then your payload gets destroyed uh, and you end up with the truck in the garage but with no payload in the back uh, and you cannot like I said retain the vehicle either and drop it in another garage with the goods in the back because again the goods will be unloaded and destroyed um, but anyway like I said it's a really really cool feature and it's definitely very very useful uh, for whatever situation you're in and I hope that this has helped you out if you need it I would very much as well appreciate if it did help you out if you could drop a like and subscribe for more content just like this. And if you need any help in SnowRunner, let me know and I will try my best to create a sort of useful guide on it. But anyway, all the best guys. Thank you very much and take care.